Well, Tamar Braxton and Vince Herbert are back for the fourth season of their hit reality show, Tamar and Vince. Yeah, and this season is more dramatic and emotional than ever before as cameras follow Tamar through a very serious health scare. Take a look. The doctors told me I need to cancel my tour, stop taping the reel, and quit dancing with the stars. They said if I didn't stop everything right now that I was doing, that the clocks could kill me. I keep getting these CT scans. I guess I want to find out where all uh, the clocks are coming from. It's like five or six days worth of tests. Wow, and Tamar and Vince join us now. Welcome back, you guys. Thank, Thank you. you. It's always great coming here. We love having you all guys here because you're just so much fun and so sweet. Now, Tamar, I gotta yes. ask you after seeing that video, is it tough for you to watch it again? It kind of is it reliving it because now it's playing out on the reality yes. show. Yes, I mean I'm definitely reliving it, but I'm counting my blessings because you know the situation did not have to end up the way that it did. Yeah. You know, yeah. A lot of people don't make it out of the hospital. Yeah. And I'm just really grateful that I did. And found the willpower and the strength yeah. to do that. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, and this all went down right in the middle of your run on Dancing with the Stars. So yeah. you had to cut that journey short, along with everything else that everything. you were doing. So yeah. is, is that hard? I feel like that's hard for you to do, to s stop moving. It, it was hard. Yeah. It was. As a matter of fact, before I got diagnosed with the blood clots, I left the, hot, the emergency room to go and dance with Nick Carter and, oh my and gosh. yeah, and do my last dance because what? I was like, well, first and foremost, I, I, I worked all week yeah, for this and dance. Were, and you were doing I'm so dancing well with the Backstreet too. Boys, and I'm dancing with Cirque du Soleil. I'm not missing this opportunity, which well, is crazy. Would you do it again? Would you sign up for it again? Um, I don't know because it was very taxing. Yeah. You know, I mean, I, if I was to ever go back, I would have to just do Dancing with the Stars and really focus. Yeah. Now, that. Since she said yes, would you be okay with her going know. back? No. <laughs> <laughs> so you can let that go. Yeah, because Vince, you you lived through all this. You know, your Yourself, your own experience, yeah, seeing the love yeah. of your life go through this. What's it like for you to, to see it play it out was on a television? Lot. It was very, uh, very heart wrenching because there's nothing I could do. Yeah. It was all left up to the grace of God and the doctors, you know. And I know how much work goes into this and how much work she put into it. Right. And I was like, it ain't worth that. How yeah. tough is it, is it for you now that she's out of the hospital and back working to kind of keep an eye on her and not let her do too much? Or well, can you can anybody control that? Well, <laughs> no. nobody can no. control that. But, but I just want you to know, it, it wasn't the workload. Yeah. It was like this fluke thing, because when you normally get blood clots, they come from your ankle and travel up to your legs. Right. Hers was in her, her, her shoulder. Huh. Yeah. And it was a bone pressing, a vein, a pressing against her vein, yeah. which ultimately made the clots come back. My father oh my got them in his legs and had to have his leg amputated because really? they could not dissolve it. Yeah. Oh, wow. wow. Well, I had to get my rib removed. Wow. Yes, wow. I did because um, I have something called thoracic outlet syndrome. Mm -hmm. And that is just when the bone is on your vein and it compresses your vein and then it clots. It oh, my God. Well, you look good and you're back yeah. better than Thank ever. You. And, yes. you know, there are all these. People are talking about you all possibly having a second baby. Vince, what's going on in the baby department? You know, her health comes first. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want another baby? And she wants one too. We've got plenty of conversations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop acting like I, I that. I want to be 100% healthy first, you know, and then we can revisit that. And yeah. it's hard well, too because Logan is every. I mean, this guy. Was he too? That's your baby he's boy. Too. Yeah. He's too. He's amazing. He is the world. Like, this guy gets up and says, I love you. And Does he? Mommy, yes. mommy. He told us yeah. he told me living to come here. I want to. Logan, wanna Logan go. wants to go. <laughs> Oh, he calls himself. Oh, yeah. 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 I love that. He gets this from his mother. Yeah. Yeah. He's yeah. like Vince, but he acts just like me. <laughs> Logan wants to go. You know, it's the best of both obviously worlds. Obviously, family is so important to you guys. Yeah. And, you know, you also see on the show, too, how important your sister's yes. support is. And, you know, especially from Tony, because she suffered, she yes. has, still suffers from lupus. Yes. Tony has been, I mean, an angel throughout this whole process. Like, yeah. I mean, she's been very militant with me, but I needed that, you know, because she was like, you, you're going back to work too soon. You're tripping. Yeah. You're putting your body through too much. Do you know what your body went through? And you yeah. know she's just like Tony for president. Like yeah. she's, <laughs> she's, she's a great sister. Yeah, yeah, she's amazing. All right. Well, one of the things that you're working on with all of your projects, new music. Yeah. Yeah. I'm actually getting ready to go back into the studio now because when I put out my album, Calling All Lovers, I couldn't support it because I got yeah. sick. Yeah. And I had to cancel my tour. Um, but I'm gonna bring out some new music that's gonna make everybody excited all over again. Oh, so I'm Vince. excited to hear it. Yeah. Yes. Come on now. Yes. Is she is she doing too much? No, she's not doing too much. <laughs> no. She's living her life. Yeah. And she's living it to the fullest. Tomorrow's not promised. That's so yeah. true. You know, you gotta be happy with inside of yourself before you can make it. We saw a clip from the video from the show where you were like, okay, 
Too much, too much. Oh, and her clothes? <laughs> it was the butter, too. It was the butter. Oh. <laughs> well, I'm from the South. I'm never giving up butter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and no one should. Yes, and that's just <laughs> not right. Well, be sure to catch Tamar and Vince Thursdays at 9 p.m. on WeTV. Always great to see you guys. Always great to be here. I love great. you guys so much. Come on, Tamar Collection. I Work. know. I have my Tamar outfit, which is from her collection. Yes. <laughs>